students leave us with um, a reputation as a Bradford student. So that when they go anywhere and they say, I've been to Bradford, that carries, um, that carries a standard or an understanding from everyone that means that they are amongst the best of the best students that come out of South Australia. That, they, that, that carries a badge that says that they are a quality student. When students come to Bradford College, what we offer them is a highly supported course, which I think is really important for international students. A lot of students haven't um, obviously worked in Australia before or studied in Australia. They don't understand about the Australian business world that we have, and it gives them a really important basis, an introduction to courses, so they're really ready to fly when they go into that first year of university. We have students from a number of countries, um, that they include China, Malaysia, Hong Kong, Saudi Arabia, Indonesia, all come to Bradford College. We're at International Pathways College that leads into University of Adelaide. So we have two major programs. We have our Foundation Studies course, which is the equivalent of the last year of secondary schooling. So students are about that age and they come to us for a year. And the other one's Degree Transfer, which is the first year of university. We give them first year of university course with an extra 15 weeks. We give smaller class sizes, extra tutorials and extra English language help, which enables students get that academic achievement that gets them into the course of their choice. My name is Andrew Wallace Thickey. I've been teaching here for five years, I think, now. Doing a year here, it uh, improves their English skills, right? Um, it gets them used to listening to people just speaking in English and instructing them in English, which, of course, they're going to have at the university. And we find that, you know, by the end of the year, the majority of the students are quite happy to have, you know, a full conversation with a teacher. So it makes teaching a pleasure, actually. The aim of critical thinking is basically to prepare students to make the transition into university. We help them to be critical thinkers, um, to think outside the box, uh, to give them skills whereby they can look at evidence and then come to their own conclusions. I spent a long time at Adelaide University so I, I know what's expected. So what, I, what we try to do is mirror the environment, um, treating them like adults, um, being responsible for their own learning. Um, because that's what they'll face when they go to university. Adelaide's a really, um, Adelaide's a great place. It's a large enough city that it has all of the facilities and, and the things that you need from a city, but it's not too large that it's impersonal. So it's, um, it's a bit like a country town in the sense that uh, you go out on a weekend and you're bound to run into someone you know. It's, uh, it's not huge in that sense. Um, it's cheaper than living in some of the other states, in particular the eastern states, significantly cheaper. Also means our students can live close to the city, if not in the city. And that's really important just in terms of access and getting home. We're known to be a really safe city. Um, where students and people feel comfortable walking around and, uh, and you can feel that when you walk around Adelaide. It's got that feeling to it. It's a really positive culture of a place. What we do with the Gold Club, one of the, one of the roles that those students um, take for us as an organisation is to act as ambassadors um, who represent our student population when we get very important people, VIPs or dignitaries, whatever, visit the college and we get that pretty regularly. We talk to them about how you'd meet and greet someone who is a very important person, what you might say. It's really very much a leadership development kind of opportunity. I go overseas and visit a lot of our different agents um, and what they tell me straight away is that the contact they get from the college from that very first application from a student is much better than they get from other educational organisations. So they don't turn up here um, and having never had any contact with anyone from the college and I think that that's really important. I know if I was a young person going to live in another country, I wouldn't want to come in totally cold. Nothing more scary than uh, that feeling of getting off the plane in an airport that you've never been to before and, um, and then not, 
not seeing anybody that you know that's going to look after you or pick you up or connect with you. So we meet that, them at the airport straight away. And I think that that's why Bradford's been such a successful educational organisation because we know what we're doing, we continue to look at ways to improve that and we make sure our focus is on making sure the students are successful.